Hi, it's Jacob from Living Healthy Every Day. Today I want to talk to you about proper food combining and why it's really important for digestion. Since digestion takes about 30 to 40 percent of your energy when you eat, you know how you get tired after you eat, you feel kind of sleepy, especially when you eat turkey with a high end tryptophan. Well, it's good to optimize your digestion. And with proper food combining, which you're going to learn today, is going to minimize the amount of energy it takes for your body to digest something. So your food's not just sitting there and getting rotting away in your body. So let's start with protein. How does protein break down in your body? Well, protein uses hydrochloric acid in the stomach. And so protein is broken down in the stomach and into amino acids for the body to use. When you eat something like, let's say, carbs like rice, that needs to be broken down by something very alkaline like saliva. Saliva is very alkaline, so it'll break down rice. But let's say you combine a burger, which is, which is a patty, which is a meat patty, right? And then you've got carbs, which is a wheat bun, which is similar to rice. It requires both saliva, which is alkaline, and uh, hydrochloric acid, which is acidic, to break it down. What does an acid and a base do when you combine them. They neutralize, right, on the pH scale. So when you put them together, they neutralize each other. So when you eat that combination, let's say a burger, it just sits in your stomach because the saliva that's alkaline and the bile that's alkaline, combined with the hydrochloric acid in your stomach that's acidic, will make that sitting there, make that sit there for a long time. And that's why food stays in there. You get bloated and gassy. So a good thing to combine is to keep those two things apart. So keep your protein and your carbs apart. And that's really easy. About 30 minutes before you're gonna eat, let's say, a rice dinner, you can eat your chicken. So you eat your chicken, you can eat vegetables in between, or you can eat your vegetables before. Vegetables are fine to be added with everything as long as they're not high, highly starchy, like potatoes or carrots. So you can put chicken and dark leafy veggies or asparagus and things like that together or you can put rice and dark leafy veggies together and then wait 30 minutes and then eat your protein and then, or 30 minutes and then eat your carbs. So that's how proper food combining works. And if you do this, this will minimize bloat. So thanks guys for watching. Stay tuned for the next episode and stay beautiful.